But one of the guys to get a lot of credit is Steve Blackman uh, for muscular development. I mean, those guys have done an extraordinary job for years and years and years to promote health, to promote fitness, to mo promote strength, to promote bodybuilding, powerlifting, weightlifting, and all of those kind of things. So the contributions they made is gigantic, and I hail them for that. Robert, what brings you out here today? Well, I'm actually here to see the fans and um, be with Gaspari, you know, inspire others and motivate people and let's get it, let's get, we can make it happen, you know? Uh, that's what I'm here for, inspiration. Oh, yeah. So you, uh, you've kind of been a rising star here in the uh, Classic Physique division. Uh, what made you jump into that division and how many shows have you done this, uh, this since you started? So I, um, I jumped into the division because it was one of those divisions that was meant, I think for me, it was kind of built for me. Uh, my physique was kind of different, you know, I had a larger back and it was harder for me to compete within the, the regular physique division and I wasn't quite big enough to do the open division. So when they announced Classic, it was one of those things that, you know, it kind of fit my, my build and it, I kind of flourished in it. I did the first Classic Physique show, which was the John Lindsay Muscle Contest. And then from there, I took the first and overall and then I went to um, Nationals, did Junior Nationals in South Carolina, Junior USA's, and I uh, took the first and overall there and got my pro card. Then jumped into a Texas show, um, the San Antonio Pro, and I won that show, and that qualified me for the Olympia last year, and uh, competed in the 2016 Olympia. Took sixth place, then once again, I competed again after it um, in the Ferrigno Legacy, and I took first place there and qualified me for this year's Olympia. So I've done quite a few shows, but it's been a good career so far. Wow, yeah, that's a lot of shows uh, in a very short amount of time. So. Coming into this year, is there anything you're going to change up? You're going to try to focus on with your training, your dieting? Well, with my physique, I've kind of learned a little bit better how to adjust my diet to fit and peak at the certain time that I need to peak. So I kind of learned that um, I stay consistent year round, so my body doesn't really fluctuate too much away from my stage weight. Um, and I've learned how to, you know, my mama's connection has gotten a lot better. So I, I think I've got a different shape coming this year, and it's going to be an interesting one. Very, very interesting. Awesome, awesome. Well, even though it's an individual sport or an art, as I like to call it, um, you know, a support system is very important. Is there anyone you'd like to thank? Well, first off, I want to thank Dennis James because he actually put me, like, and showed me so much and taught me so much about not just bodybuilding but about life as well. My girlfriend keeps me grounded. You know, yeah. she it makes sure my head doesn't get too big, and I and I love it about it because it's it's legitimately one of those sports that you can actually gotta get carried away with and think it's me, 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 and forget everything else. And it's really not about that. It's but honestly about inspiring others. Gaspari has taught me so much as well. Me and Rich are like really, really good friends as well. As you know, I work for him, but he's a really good friend and he mentored as well and taught me so much. So I gotta thank all of them and my family, man. They support me to the fullest. So at the end of the day, I know it's not me. You know, it's, it's all about them and helping all these people who actually are fans, because I didn't realize, I really lost track of realizing that I'm not anything without my fans. And my fans love me and I love them. And it's so cool to inspire them. So that's one of those things that I have to and really appreciate. I really appreciate it. Awesome, awesome. Well, there you have it, Robert Sims, a.k.a. Mr. Classic Physique. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.